We'll play an outstanding football team this week. NC State has uh, played outstanding this year. Uh, defensively, extremely experienced. Front seven with a lot of experience. Seems like the same five, uh, same seven guys the last three years. Uh, front is very good, have good depth in their linebackers. Boy, very rarely take a false step, stay on their keys. Uh, secondary guys are big and long. Front guys strong. Uh, run, play, play extremely well uh, in every phase of the, of the uh, game. Uh, played a great option team this week, confirming how disciplined they were when they played. Did a great job there. Marshall scored a couple early, then they were able to shut them down. Marshall had very good skill guys. Uh, offensively, quarterback's playing lights out. I mean, he can flat plays, completing over 75% of his passes. Uh, can really play. Uh, Jalen Samuels is just the epitome of a football player. Can play everywhere, do everything, catch, run, block, throw. I mean, there's nothing he can't do. Uh, receiver uh, seven can just flat he returns it, whether he runs it. Uh, you know, anything can uh, make plays just all over the daggone field. He plays tailback. But, and he, like I say, he's a shorter guy, but he's very stocky and strong. He's 100, almost 195, 200 pounds. So he can right arm tackles. It's hard to get down on. Can run routes. Gets the ball in space. Tight ends. Offensive line do a great job up front in the zone blocking schemes. Uh, just a really good football team. Special teams punter can average over 43 yards. Good kickoffs. They broke a kickoff last week for about 60, so doing a great job in the special teams. And, you know, they uh, always get ready to play us. A lot of Florida kids on their team, and they play very well. And uh, it's going to be a heck of a matchup for us coming off uh, that long layoff. And uh, we're going to have to play really, really well and uh, uh, to have a chance to, to compete right there and play with them. But, again, I liked how we practiced. Uh, our guys, I think, are ready to play. So we just got to go out and play. Questions? Uh, Jim, of course, that was the team last year that played you guys tough. What do you kind of remember about just the way they do things and what improvements have you seen from NC State from last well, year Last year they year? did a great job of keeping the ball. They converted on third downs, uh, made some plays, had field, won the field position battle. We started most drives backed up. So they had we had long fields to go most of the game, almost every drive. Uh, we had big drives when we had it, didn't have it as much. Uh, defense really played well the second half. They got us the first half a little bit, and then we had some big drives in the second half. Uh, we had a big critical drive to get out and win the game. But uh, they, they played the run real well. Uh, they, they defend well. They don't give up a lot of big, big plays. Uh, offensively, like I said, the quarterback's very smart, and he's much more – he's very athletic, can run when he has to, knows where he's going with the ball. Uh, I mean, they did a great job. and they, they, sh they kept the field long on us, and they moved the ball, converted third down. I think we're 8 of 16 on the day for third downs last year, and uh, had some third and longs, did a great job. Last week, Derwin said that – Samuels kind of reminded him of the offensive version of him. Do you see some similarities? That's a great. That's a great analogy. It really is. That, that, that shows you how how aware why you, why you like Derwin so much as a player and why he's so good because he can recognize other people who see the game. Because to do the things that Samuels does, there's not only great physical skills there. There's great mental skills, great intelligence to be able to play the different positions, understand how to play them, and play them so effectively and run the different route combinations and touch the ball so many different ways and block. I mean, that, that, that's, a, that's a great analogy by Derwin. And, and like I said, the epitome of Samuels to me is, and to me it's the ultimate comedy. That guy's a football player, can do anything.